Hey guys, I review apps 95 here. Now as you guys know on my channel, I've never posted a Call of Duty gameplay. I've had a few people ask me if I play Call of Duty or and if I do, would I post a gameplay? And so here's a COD 4 gameplay. Uh, COD 4 is my favorite Call of Duty game. I really, really love it. It's just a fantastic game. Uh, as you guys know though, on my channel, I typically don't post, well, as I said, I don't post any Call of Duty gameplay. Mostly play uh, Homefront. I play a lot of Homefront. I play a lot of uh, Medal of Honor and uh, occasionally Battlefield, uh, yeah, occasionally. But anyway, let's talk about the gameplay here. And what I want to talk about is camping versus defensive play, because I think that these get mixed up quite a bit in Call of Duty, and it's too bad because they're completely different things, but people tend to mix them up and put them in the same category, which I don't think is right. And so, also, before we talk about it, uh, there are lots of JD players from the JD clan, which is a very professional Call of Duty uh, clan. They're all really, really good players. There's at least five in here in this lobby that I was playing with. And so, considering that, I think I did a pretty good job on this game. It was uh, pretty difficult. They're all really, really good players. So, I uh, was having a hard time holding my own. But... I think the end score is pretty good. So anyway, camping versus defensive play. All right, let's talk about um, camping first, and we'll kind of you know tell you about that first, and then we'll talk about defensive play. So camping is laying down or sitting in a corner doing absolutely nothing, waiting for someone to walk by so that you can shoot them. That's camping, all right? You're not moving about. You're just sitting down in a corner or a place that you think maybe someone wouldn't see you. And when someone walks by, you can shoot them. It's an easy kill, all right? So that's camping. Now, defensive play is exactly what I'm doing right here. I'm defending this entire building. I'm not sitting in a corner, and I'm. but then again, I'm not just perched right here in this big open spot, you know, taking kills like that. I'm moving down the stairs. I'm t watching my right. I'm looking for spawns. I'm, again, moving down here. And so this is defensive play. And honestly, it's... It's the smart way to go, at least in my opinion. It's more strategic because once people figure out where you are, uh, it's tough to hold the spot. And so then right here I spawned right outside the building and now I'm basically just temporarily uh, defending this one area here so that I can move back up. And so this is the way I like to play. I I just like it. I don't like rushing. I know most people play Call of Duty, that's all they do is rush. And if you do, that's great. No problem there. Uh, I personally just don't like it. It's It just leaves too much up to chance, I feel. And uh, I'm a very strategic player and I like to use as much skill as possible opposed to just chance. And so when I move up and I actually am, I guess, rushing per se, um, I want to you know, make sure that I can actually get into a building, clear it out, and get kills. I don't want to leave anything up to chance, which is hard to do in Call of Duty because so much of it is left up to chance, but I feel that playing defensively like this um, kind of helps eliminate some of that uh, chance, I suppose. So uh, defensive play, again, that is oftentimes mistaken as camping and they're two completely different things as I was saying and um, yeah I just I love defensive play it's the only way I can play any game really and uh, I just I think it's a lot of fun camping I despise I don't think is right in the least bit so I don't want to mix any of you guys up and think that I'm somehow agreeing with camping or think that it's fine I, I don't at all I think it's cheap and stupid and um, I definitely do not like to do it. This guy right here, JD Shoes, he is uh, one of the top JD players. Really, really good player. I play with him a lot, and he's just an awesome guy. Um, of course, the whole clan is really, really fun. So, um, yeah, this is the end of the commentary, though, guys. Hope you guys enjoy it, and uh, I will catch you later. Bye.